Megan Stouter and I'm so glad to welcome you back to Newmar's campus to explore the 2022 London Air 4551. This coach is going to be built exclusively on our Spartan chassis. It's going to have a 605 horsepower engine. It's also going to come with a 12.5 kilowatt Onan generator, which is going to be on an electric slide here in the front cab for you. Right behind me, a couple of features is you're going to see our chrome side mirrors. You're also going to have a stainless steel trim plate um, all the way around, which is an option available to you. Underneath the packaging is going to be a Newmar chrome plate. That's just there because we want to protect it on its way down to the dealer and retail. Up here, you're going to see our mobile eye camera, which I'll touch on a little bit more on the interior. And as I said, this is going to be our front cap here. It's going to have a front um, shield protection with its paint. Along with that, you're going to have our bonded windshields. That's going to give you a little bit more of an automobile-like feel. So our competitors actually leave a gap between their windshields where we don't, we do bond them. And this coach is going to be great for anyone who is a couple. They're going to be great for anyone who is looking for that 605 horsepower engine who maybe wasn't able to afford one now. It's also going to be great for anyone that is a full-time RVer or snowbirds who have a discerning taste. And then along with that, it's going to be great for anyone who requires luxurious, stylish, and residential travel. Covering the door side of this 4551 London Air, what you're going to see first and foremost is going to be a keyless entry pad here. So you're going to see the assist handle going in and out of the steps, which avoids any kind of collision or any falls. Along with that, I say keyless, so you're going to be able to create your own pin. So you can completely customize this. It also has a fun doorbell, which everybody kind of loves if you're coming up to a new RV. And then you're going to see here with the one is going to be a lock button. So if you press and hold that, it's going to lock your doors and all of your bays so you don't have to do that manually. Opening this door, you're going to have a three slide hydraulic system. So it's going to come out and it's going to go all the way to the ground for you. So that provides easy access. It's just a small step up and you don't have to worry about tripping over anything. And then I want to go ahead and focus on our awning package. So this comes standard with our Gerard awning package, which includes two Nova side awnings, which you'll see up top in the front and the back. You're also going to have slide out covers. You're going to have a power entrance door awning, and then you're also going to have the window awnings covered as well. A really cool and unique feature about this London Air 4551 is going to be the special exterior graphics. So what you see here, the dealer went ahead and completely customized the paint graphics to match what they wanted and what was going to be a little bit more desirable to their retail customers. What you'll hear throughout my videos is, as I'm talking about now, is going to be specials, standards, and options. So this is going to be an additional charge. It doesn't come included in the coach. But what you can do if you don't want to special or customize it, you can choose one of our standard options, which are going to be Cheswick, Sirocco, Geneva, or Paxton. Along with our paint here, no matter if it's a special or a standard option, it's going to come with our full paint masterpiece finish. We also use the brand of BASF, so that's really cool that comes on luxury cars as well, so it's a well-known brand. This London Air is going to come with a cut and buff and a clear coat finish. This actually has six coats of clear coat, so um, down is one and back is another one. So it comes with six total, but three layers. Along with that, if you ever run into one of our new Mars, go ahead and run your hands along our paint here. And what you're going to find is through each different graphic, there's going to be no bumps. So that's the nice thing about cut and buff is all of our people in production, they hand, they go through and hand cut and buff this to allow for a nice cleaner finish. And it also gives it a really nice mirror look to it. Walking down this exterior here, we're going to point out a couple of bays and unique features. So first and foremost, you're going to see your diesel fuel tank over here. So keep in mind your fuel tank and your def tank are both going to be refillable on both sides, which allows for easy access whether you're in the campground or you're going into the gas station. Walking into the first bay here, what you're going to find is going to be our Dometic freezer. So it's going to be on a manual pull-out tray. Comes all the way out. And then something new for this year is going to be a shelf above this freezer. So that provides for easy storage or anything like that. We can open these up. And something that's really cool within these freezers is over here, you're going to see a pad. 
So this is going to be completely customizable. So you can um, customize the temperature to what you feel fit, whether that's freezer meat or if you have um, beverages on the other one. And between your Dometic freezer, right out here, you're also going to have your exterior entertainment system, which is great for tailgating. So a lot of people will take these to games. I have a friend on Facebook who takes hers down to Purdue games all the time. So putting the big game on here or anything you want, essentially, you can turn on your Samsung TV. It's gonna be a 43 inch out here in the exterior. This doesn't come standard, but it is an option available to you. So keep that in mind. Along with that, you're gonna have a Bose sound bar. And this Bose sound bar, it's gonna have a digital switch over here. So you can have that in the off position. You can turn it to TV, which whatever is playing on the TV is gonna play out of that speaker. Or if you have inside the house mode turned on in your navigation system, you have house mode, whatever's playing over the dash radio is gonna play outside of the speaker, which is really cool. And then just below your exterior entertainment system is gonna be your bay two. So here you're gonna have an optional power slide tray. So it's gonna have a button here so you can pull this out. So this is gonna come out and you can put it back in. And then again, just as shown in bay one, you're gonna have that extra shelf up top. Bay three, again, another shelf. You're gonna have another optional power tray here. So again, this comes out and it goes all the way back in. And something I wanna point out real quick is you're gonna have our block foam insulation on the side walls along with our basement floor. So keep that in mind, it's gonna be really well insulated. So whatever you have down there, it's gonna keep warm for the most part. Just remember in the winter that can um, affect it and you'll have to winterize that. Along with that, <clears throat> if we get down here, you're gonna see these diagonal beams. So what those are gonna be, is gonna be our star foundation. So what that stands for is strong, true, and robust. And that is a steel superstructure created by the engineers here at Newmar. And what that does is it provides a little bit more strength and integrity to your coach. And those diagonal trusts allows for all of the movements and bumps in the road to go to the center of the coach, providing again, just a quieter, more stable ride for you. Moving here into bay four, you're gonna have a manual tray. So this isn't powered, but you can go ahead and manually pull this out. Along with that, you're gonna have the road vac, which is our central vac system that does come standard on the London Air. So keep that in mind, it's not an option here. And then you're also gonna have two 110V outlets as well. Here in bay five, you're gonna have a pegboard. So if you have any tools or construction items, that is a great place to put them. My mother-in-law does her arts and crafts down here. So it's just a nice space to hang anything up that you might have. And then located here, just above me before we continue moving on, is gonna be one of your side cameras that comes with your 360 view. <clears throat> and rounding out the coach, you're gonna have your def tank. Again, this is refuelable on both sides. And then right here, you're gonna have your chassis batteries. And the rear of our coach here, you're gonna have your tow hitch below, which is a 20,000 pound tow hitch rating. Along with that, you're gonna have the safe hall, which is a Spartan exclusive on the chassis. So safe hall is gonna be your air braking integrated system. And then you're also gonna have your rear camera that comes in with your 360 view camera. And working our way to the off door side here, this London Air. First and foremost, on the back side, you're gonna see our side radiator. You're also gonna have that def tank fill over here. So again, fillable on both sides. You're gonna have a little compartment. It's just gonna be small for any maybe hoses or anything like that, something that's dirty and just small. Along with that, you're gonna have your last bay back here. So this is gonna be your waterwork system. So what you're gonna see is a really nice stainless steel plate back here. And then new for this year is also gonna be a digital panel. And then you're also gonna have your exterior shower head here, which is really nice. So if you've been out hiking or at the beach and you wanna rinse off before you take all that dirt and grime inside, that's a great use of it. 
You're gonna have your RV SantaCon system here. It's gonna walk you through how to winterize your coach, which is really nice because I wouldn't know how to do it unless I had instructions. You're gonna have your gray tank rinse, your black tank rinse. You're gonna have the drain points. You're also gonna have your tank fill and auto supply and then your uh, hot and cold drain points as well. And then along with that is, you'll see this hose right here, this pink one. So that pink liquid actually lets you know that this coach has already been winterized for you. And moving right along here, you're gonna have the next bay over. So this is gonna be your power rewind wheel. So this is gonna be what you plug into the campground. So we're gonna pull this out for you. And then you can simply just click this button here and it's gonna rewind back up. And also something I wanna point out is gonna be these lips right here. So when you pull that out, what you can do is you can shove this between these lips and you can close this door. So it's really nice and really simple. Right here, you're gonna have your Oasis chin hook heating system. So new for this year is it's gonna be a dual loop. Here is gonna be that full pass through power tray that's optional. I'll go ahead and point this out too. So this button's gonna be on the side. It's gonna come out. It'll come fully out. I'll demonstrate it right here for you since I didn't do it on that side. So as you can see, it's gonna be a really nice long and wide tray. So if you have any luggage, maybe you're um, going on a hiking excursion, you have hiking poles or something, this is gonna be really great for any of that stuff and it goes the full length here. And that simply just goes back in. And while we're waiting for that, I'll go ahead and point out a few things with my camera guy here. So over here, you're gonna see our side camera which matches the 360 view which we keep pointing out. You're also going to see those window awnings and the Gerard awnings on the side here as well. And this cargo tray actually has a hundred or a thousand pound capacity. And right here in the next bay, you're going to have another power tray. So again, just a simple click of the button that'll come out. But what I want to point out on this one that I didn't in this one is going to be when this full slide is out, it's actually super difficult to get underneath that slide and pull those trays out or even have access to whatever's underneath, especially anything that's heavy. So when these slides come all the way out, it pr provides you just an easier access to whatever's underneath that compartment. Here you're gonna see your eight house batteries. So this is a manual tray, so this will come out um, keep in mind you have to pull out the pins on the sides. Once both pins are pulled out, you can go ahead and have access to those. You're going to have your diesel fuel tank here again. And then rounding out the front, you're just going to have your electrical panel. So again, you probably won't have too much to do with it, but service will. And this is something that you just keep in mind that this is where all of your electrical stuff is going to be. And rounding out this off door side, you're gonna have our chrome mirrors here. So again, that's gonna be one on each side. You're gonna have your side cameras in each on the lower mirror here. Along with that, it's gonna be auto defrost and it's gonna be heated for you. Making our way to the interior, the London Air 4551 for the 2022 model year, what you're gonna see is luxury. You're gonna see residential style stuff between the shower, the seats, the space in here with the full wall slide out and two partial slide outs. And you're also gonna see a ton of technology throughout. But first and foremost, we're gonna focus over here on our passenger side. So as you immediately step into the coach, what you're gonna find is two assisting handles right here. So you're gonna have one on your left-hand side and one on your right-hand side. So these are gonna be super nice when you're coming into the coach. Along with that, if you are a passenger sitting here, you're gonna be able to have a step cover right here. The button is gonna be simply on this side, so you're gonna go ahead and click that out. And this step cover is gonna come all the way out. Obviously with me standing here, it won't but it's gonna come out and it's gonna come up. So it's gonna be a flush top for you. And that just allows you to have a more comfortable sitting when you're going down the road. Put that back in. Along with that, something you can option in is going to be this passenger monitor over here. 
So what this allows you to do is basically control everything that the driver would be able to control within the navigation, the radio, what have you, and the cameras. That way you can focus on the navigation and the cameras where he or she can focus on the driving. Along with that, you're gonna have a cup holder and wireless charging station over here. So you don't have to worry about bringing any extra wires in here. Maybe you left your phone charger at home, no worries. Put your phone on top and it's gonna charge for you. Along with that, you're gonna have a passenger workstation. So this is gonna come out and it's gonna come down. So whether you're working on the road, a lot of people have turned to remote work with the latest COVID trend. And then you're also gonna have a nice station here for a cup. And again, it's just like an anywhere you want to enjoy a meal or work. And that's just gonna fold back up like this and go back down. And what you're gonna see with our passenger seats, um, our captain seat, and then our furniture throughout is gonna be our Villa Ultra Leather uh, Furniture. So it's gonna be a really nice look. What is optioned into this package is gonna be our packs and decor. So throughout with the fabrics, the valances, the furniture, the bedding, it's all gonna be packs and decor. Right behind me, you're gonna see our dash. So this is gonna be a two-tone dash. So you're gonna have your black up top and that nice cream below that matches your leather. Just giving it a little bit more of a sleek and sexier look up front. Along with that, you're gonna have a overhead Samsung TV. So this is gonna be a 43 inch TV. Throughout, you're gonna have our JBL sound system. So you're gonna have speakers up top and then you're gonna have speakers throughout. And even though you might see one speaker underneath, that actually will resonate to anywhere from two to three to four, depending on the brand. So keep that in mind as well. Same focus up top, you're gonna have our cabinets. So throughout, you're gonna see our Bermuda maple glazed high gloss cabinets optioned in. So right up top above the captain's chair, you're gonna have your control panel. You're gonna become very familiar with this. So between your slide outs, your awnings, you're gonna have your KIB panel up here as well. You're also gonna have um, security lights, your drapes, what have you. This is all gonna be controlled by you. So just become very familiar, play with it when you get your coach. And if you have questions, you can always call and ask us. As I mentioned outside, you're gonna have your mobile eye camera. So it's gonna be centered in your front of your dash. With your mobile eye, it's gonna have your lane tracking and land departure warning. It's also gonna provide haptic feedback to your captain. So whether you are maybe swerving out and in and out of the lanes, it's gonna go ahead and vibrate for you and just allow you, hey, maybe we need to stop for a coffee break. Along with the haptic feedback and the vibrations, it's also gonna beep for you as well. New for this year is gonna be a new 10 inch Excite radio dash right here. So you're gonna have two dual monitors. You're gonna have your radio and navigation over here and your cameras. Um, if we had the video detected, you can turn this on. It's gonna give you that 360 view throughout the coach. And it's also gonna have a, with a 360 view, you can also have like a bird's eye view. So it's gonna show you each side of the coach no matter what, so it's really cool. You're also gonna have your generator start up here. So that's gonna be an important button for you and your climate controls underneath. Along with that, again, it's gonna be built on our Spartan chassis. So with that, this coach is gonna come with our Comfort Drive and passive steering. So Comfort Drive is gonna be a computer software within the um, steering wheel that allows any bumps in the road or crosswinds to come in. And basically the coach is gonna absorb that and it's gonna take all that motion and it's gonna take it off of the driver. So they have a little bit more of a smoother and more comfortable of a ride. Along with that, you're gonna have our HWH uh, leveling system. So that's the brand we use. So you can use those for your leveling jacks. And then the last thing I wanna point out is you're also gonna have a powered opening window here on the driver's side. And as I'm looking at, you're also gonna have your owner support. So when you get a new Mar, you're always gonna have a brand specialist, no matter what, specific to your brand. So for this London Air, you're gonna be able to call up Rick. He'll be able to answer your questions during normal business hours. And the nice thing though, is that they're available 24 seven. It might not always be your specific brand specialist because everybody does get time off on the weekends and um, after hours, but they're available to you to help you with any service on the road or any technical issues or anything just specifically um, to your brand that you might have questions about. And just to backtrack a little bit, I wanna go ahead and point out with the new dash radio for this year, you're also gonna have the new nav and go system. So that's gonna be your new navigation system and that takes away the Rand McNally from years past. 
What this does is it allows for a little bit more of a seamless navigation system because it allows for all updates to come through the cloud or over the air. So you don't have to worry about inserting a SIM card or anything like that. With Nav and Go 2, you can go ahead and put in your vehicle's dimensions manually and it will give you the best um, route for you and what you're comfortable with, avoiding mountains or any kind of off-roading terrain as well. Along with that, your driver is also going to have a wireless charging pad over here. So just like your passenger, you don't have to worry about cords or plugging anything in, but that's going to be over here available to you. And then really quick to round out this cockpit area, your captain's chairs are going to be powered. So you're going to be able to recline these. They're going to have the footrest, and then you can also swivel around and enjoy your company that might be joining you. As you make your way to the heart of your coach where you're going to spend a lot of your time is your living space and your kitchen. And as you can see behind me and in front of me is going to be luxury. It's beautiful. It's so eye catching. The lights, the Bermuda maple glazed high gloss cabinets, the handles, just like everything comes together and gives it a really nice sexy look. But what I want to focus on here is going to be your floor. So you're going to have tile floors beneath you. But what comes standard is really nice. It's actually going to be electric heated floors. So you don't have to worry about that if you're traveling in the winter or if you just like to have something a little bit cozy instead of wearing slippers, those are going to be heated for you. Over here, what's featured is going to be an optional trifold sofa. So it's going to be 60 inches. It's going to be able to be pulled out into a bed. But what comes standard is actually going to be a jackknife sofa. And then along with this, when you get the trifold sofa and optioned in, you're going to also option the theater seats. So you're going to have two theater seats here. They're going to be powered. But what this does in lieu of is going to be a standard high to bed sofa. So just keep that in mind. Everything you're going to see furniture wise in the living room is going to be optioned in. So this doesn't come standard with your coach specifically. But your theater seats, you're going to have cup holders. You're also going to have a center compartment here. So you're going to have a nice storage space here for anything you're also going to have a nice shelf here so you can put snacks books toys whatever have you in there you're again going to have your seats so they're going to be able to come out again they're powered so it's going to be super easy and comfortable and again those are going to come down and then directly across from your theater seats is going to be your televator right behind your sofa so what you're going to see here is going to be an extra piece of your solid surface countertops. That's going to be your televator, so that's going to be a simple up and down, and I'll go ahead and demonstrate that for you. Along with your televator, on each side, you're going to have two 110V outlets, and then on the left-hand side, you're going to have two USB ports. And how you're going to turn the elevator on and up is going to be over here. So you're going to go ahead and go into Systems on your KVA panel, and you're going to click TV Lift Up. Don't press it down, just click it and it's going to come up for you. <coughs> so the TV featured here is going to be a 50 inch Samsung HD TV. It's going to be a 4K HD TV. So it's the best quality that Samsung has and Samsung is literally the leading brand in the industry for all TVs and electronics. So we use the best of the best here in our London Air and our coaches throughout. comes up it's beautiful and then along with that you're also going to have a Bose soundbar up top so this provides speakers throughout they're going to be little speakers um, throughout here so that provides ample sound no matter where you're sitting on the coach whether you're working in the kitchen you're sitting in the theater seats or maybe you're in the captain's chair you're going to be able to hear everything throughout from this TV and then just below you're going to have your cabinets again you're going to have more outlets the feeds for um, any auxes or USB ports or HDMI's and then we're just going to keep moving here throughout so right behind me you're going to have our kitchen so again you're going to have the Bermuda maple glazed high gloss cabinet you're going to have a 30 inch stainless steel whirlpool microwave it's going to be really nice and opened up you can cook a lot of things in here just test it out you can cook bacon you can cook bread you can cook cookies just try it and test and see what you like and what fits you i'd also recommend especially in the vented microwave if it's available to you on this coach because venting the microwave actually takes all of that smell like if you're cooking bacon it takes all that smell and moves it to the outside of the coach which is really nice that's not standard but it's a special available to you if you want 
Something they optioned in is going to be the kitchen window. So it's going to be an added window. It's going to provide extra light, which really opens this up. So just imagine a full wall there. Um, it'd be a little bit darker, but this is really nice and clean. Along with that, you're going to have a really pretty grouted backsplash. So we do all of our grouting in hand here in house. So our production guys will do that, which is a really nice special touch. Along with that in our cabinets, again, you're going to be able to have these here in house. They're going to be screwed and glued, so they're not going to be stapled. Some of our competitors just staple them, giving it a little bit more um, cheap of a maintenance. So you can come in and you can tug on ours and it's not going to fall off. It's not going to move. It's really, really secure. So go to our competitors, see the difference with Numar through our cabinets and just the little touches with our grouted backsplash and solid surface countertops as well. Speaking of, you're going to have the solid surface countertops below. So what you're going to see here is they optioned in the all electric induction cooktop, but you're going to be able to have the solid surface uh, cutting boards essentially in covers. So you can cover up that induction cooktop when you're done. And then you're also going to have the cutting board underneath, which provides a little bit less stuff coming into the coach. Along with that, we'll go ahead and remove both of these because this is actually removable. And what I mean by that is you can actually take this out and cook on it outside. So let's just pull it up. You can unplug it. And then you can simply just carry this outside and use it and then bring it right back in when you're done. And right across from your kitchen is going to be where you're dining. So this is going to be an optioned in power extend a flex dinette. What comes standard is going to be a hide a leaf dinette, but they went ahead and optioned this in. So we're going to go ahead and demonstrate it for you. So what you have here is your simple dinette booths, but it's going to be powered. So that you're just going to simply click this and it's going to come out for you. And it's going to do it on both sides. So it provides additional space and seating for guests. And then the seat's going to come up and out and it's going to be flush with the other seats. And as you saw behind me on the theater seats, you're going to have additional cushions on the back. So again, that provides some really cool space here and just additional seating and it's really nice and you can just put it away. Along with that, this is going to be an extended dinette. So you're just going to pull out on the sides. This comes all the way out, so they also have space for eating or just entertainment if you're playing cards. And that's going to have a leaf that's going to be underneath your bed that you can put in and out when you need to use it. You simply just press this in, and then we'll take this off. And you can press this back in. It's going to go down, and then it'll just simply go back in for you. Something really cool and unique about Numar is we focus on, you know, what makes us different, the differences here. And we like the small touches, the unique touches, and we don't waste any space or any storage. So underneath this dinette is going to be a small cabinet. So you can use that for paper, card games, what have you underneath. Along with that, I want to go ahead and show you this fun island. So you just click this button, pull it out. So you're going to have an island here, so this is going to be a space for um, additional food or chopping or cutting if you have multiple people in the kitchen. And you might say, oh, well, what about my drawers? They're still here. So again, nothing is wasted within this really cool island. And basically, just don't be afraid to shove that thing in there. Along with that, through the woodworking, I want to go ahead and just point out the little details. So you're going to see the grooves throughout um, the top balances here within our ceiling and our doors and the cabinets here. You're going to see everything is very nice and small and detailed. Along with that, you're going to see our designer ceiling up top. So through all of our brands, not just the one in here, you're going to see some sort of designer brand ceiling that makes it like this is Newmar, this is a London Air. With this, you're going to see all the really pretty lights throughout. You're also going to see when you're underneath, you're going to have lights coming up into that stainless steel plate up top. And that again, just provides 
extra exuberance, luxury, and classiness throughout. And what this covers, why we do this too, is this is where your central vac system is gonna be, or AC system. So it's gonna be centrally located. So when your slides are in and you're going down the road, it doesn't have to peel over the slides like some competitors. It's all gonna be centrally located, which provides you ample air in the heat no matter what. And then along with that, as you can see the ceiling covers, you're also gonna see this cover behind me. So this is gonna be a fantastic vent here with rain sensor. And the reason I'm pointing it out, um, even though it's really cool when this is open, it prevents the rain from getting in, but you're gonna see this additional woodwork covering it, the vent space. And it matches your cabinets and your ceiling and everything else. And some competitors will actually just leave this open looking, but here at Newmar, we go ahead and match it to everything else, give it that luxury look, and it's gonna be a nice wooded cover for your vent. And here in the midship of your coach is going to be a residential style whirlpool fridge. So you're going to go ahead and you're going to have that in the unlocked position and you can open this up. Again, ample drawers and cabinets and storage space. And then you're going to have your freezer underneath. It's going to be dual layered. So you're going to have two levels and then you're also going to have an ice maker as well. And then just make sure that you lock this back up when you're done. That way these don't fly open and damage anything on your coach when you're going down the road and your slides are in. Along with that, you're going to have a water dispenser here on the front side. Right next door, you're going to have a pantry and the lights are going to come on when you open it. Along with that, you're going to have tons of space in here for goodies. And these are adjustable, so if you have maybe cereal boxes or anything a little bit taller, you can go ahead and adjust these as you want to the height you want. And to get these out, it's going to be a push release. You're going to push in and pull out and just click it back in. And directly across from your refrigerator and pantry is going to be your midship bath. So here you're going to see a nice swivel hinge door. So this is Newmar engineered and it just provides easier access to the restroom when you're going down the road and the slides are in. As we step in here, you're going to see the solid surface countertops. You're going to see some cabinets up here. Well, this is going to be your electrical panel and then you're going to again have that fantastic vent with that Newmar cover plate underneath that matches your cabinets. You're going to have a nice window. You're going to have that grouted backsplash again that's done in-house here in Newmar. You're going to have some drawers down here. You're going to have an undermounted sink. You're going to have a medicine cabinet with vanity lights and this can open up. And within here you're going to have two 110V outlets as well. We're going to go ahead and make our way into the master bedroom here. So as we're entering here, you're going to have a manual sliding door. So you can go ahead and close this all the way up if you want a little bit of privacy or if you're going to sleep or if you have kiddos and you want to just separate a little bit, you can do that as well. As we make our way in here, again, you're going to see that Newmar brand design ceiling cover up here. Again, this is where you're central AC system is going to be located. Within your master bedroom, you're going to have a ton of space right here. So you can have your king size bed along with your cabinet space over here. So again, you're going to have the solid surface countertops. You're going to have your drawers up top and your cabinets. You're going to also have a egress window. And then you're also going to have another 43 inch Samsung TV in here. And right underneath you're going to have two 110V outlets. And then you're going to have your slide out button over here. So this is going to be for your bedroom. And then you're going to have another KIB panel right here for you. And what's really cool about this KIB panel here in the master bedroom is going to be the all lights off function. So let's say you're laying in bed, you're both comfy, neither one of you wants to get up to shut off the lights. You can go ahead and just click that all, life, all lights off function and nobody has to argue, nobody has to worry about it, just simple click of the button. And what I want to point out is going to be your silver leaf panel back here as well. So there's one up front above the cabin seat and one back here. So what you can see here is on the home screen you're going to have your battery levels, your chassis, so house and chassis. You can go ahead and click AC power, your generator, your water. You're going to see that there's 1% in the fresh, 0% in the black, and 2% in the gray tank. Um, water pump, you can go to climate, so you can adjust that how you want with the heat or the air. And this is going to be really cool for you to see all things and all functions within your coach. 
Along with that is there's actually going to be an app on your phone that you can download. It's compatible with Apple or Android. And so with your Silverleaf system in house, you can also use that outside within your Wi-Fi range. And then directly across from your cabinets and drawer space and TV is going to be your master bed. So as I mentioned before, this is going to be a king size bed. So what people have here is going to be an option in power retractable bed with an air mattress. So this doesn't come standard, just keep that in mind. But they want to have an option in that's just going to be a simple click of the button here. So we can go ahead and lift this up and it's going to come back. And again, so if you're just reading a book, you want to sit up, you're watching TV, it hurts your neck to lay down, you can go ahead and use that. And what I want to go ahead and point out too is you're going to see the packs and decor within these um, packages. So we will never open this up and use it because it's zip tied and it's going to go down to our dealers and retail customers. We don't ever want to get that dirty or damage it. But I wanted to have it out so you could see the design and the pillows and everything else. Along with this bed frame, what you're going to see below is going to be a really pretty woodwork. And then you're also going to have the LED lights that come around. So it just provides a little bit sexier look around the bed with the lighting. And as we put this bed back down, you're going to see that really pretty headboard behind you. And with the power retractable bed, you're not going to have windows on the sides. And then up top here, you're going to have reading lights. You can click on and off. And then you're also going to have the KIB panels. And then you're going to have some 110V outlets up top in the back there. And then in this cabinet here, what you're going to see is, you can't really see it, so I apologize, but it's going to be an opening right here. And you can basically um, swim out any wires through there. So if you have a sleeping machine or CPAC machine, you can go ahead and simply use that. And it gives it a really nice clean look instead of a bunch of wires everywhere when you sleep. And before we move on from the master bedroom, I want to go ahead and point out our nightstands on both sides here. So what might just look like a normal cabinet, you're actually going to be able to open that up and you're going to have two 110V outlets along with two USBs. So if you want to plug your phone in at night or laptop or iPad, it's really easy and it takes it off of the front and just gives it a nice cleaner look throughout the coach. Let's go ahead and step inside. So again, as you walk in here, you're going to have the nice heated tile floors throughout. You're going to have that Bermuda maple glazed high gloss finish cabinets. And then you're also going to have a really pretty shower in here. So what you're going to see is we can unlock this for it. This is going to come out and open up. There we go. And I'll go ahead and step inside so we can kind of get a better look here. And I'll let my cameraman get in here as well. So as you can see here, you're going to see the tile shower walls and floors. Again, it's going to have that grouted look here in house at Newmar. You're going to have option in is assist handles in the shower. You're going to have a standing shower head up top along with a retractable one right here. So you can move that and use as you want. And then behind me, you're going to have our water saving system, which is our AquaView miser system. So you're going to have this blue light and this handle down here. So what that does is when you turn that handle on, it's going to essentially prevent the water from coming out until it's hot, so until it's ready. So it's going to cycle that water through a tube. And when that's ready, this light is going to turn blue. So when the water is hot and at the temperature that you desire, you can turn that shower on and the water will come out. That's great if you're dry camping or if you don't have a ton of water in your tanks. That's really nice and it's very um, environmental as well. And then over here you're going to have your soap dispensers and you're going to have a folding shower seat. So you can use that as you want. And then directly across from your shower is going to be your stacked washer and dryer. So just open this up and I'll keep this one closed for video purposes so you can see. But you're going to have the vented cabinets up top so that provides the, all that hot air to get out and that steam. And then underneath, you're actually going to have a drawer. Again, we don't waste any storage space, so that's usable to you underneath as well. And then within this, you're going to have your solid surface countertops matching your solid surface throughout. So keep that in mind, it matches throughout. You're going to have two really nice undermounted sinks back here with the stainless steel faucets. You're going to have that 
backsplash that matches the backsplash in your midship. So that's going to be that really pretty grouted look. Again, done in-house here at Newmar. You're going to have your KIB panel, so if you want to turn on your vanity lights, you can do so. Your accent lights. You can turn on your mirror lights. And there you have it. So it gives it a really nice, pretty look throughout here. And you're also going to have some cabinets over here. So you're going to have two 110V outlets over here within the cabinet space. Your towel rings. And then you're going to have ample drawers underneath. And they're going to be soft closed. So as you saw, I'll push that in. And it's going to close itself. And then underneath, again, you're just going to have cabinets. And these lights are going to come on as you open it. Underneath, again, you're going to have... 110V outlets, you're going to have them on each side of here, so you're never going to run out of electrical outlets to use. You also have the LED lights under here for your foot space, so if you're coming to the bathroom in the middle of the night, you can have your accent lights. Right behind me, you're going to have your commode, your egress door, and then you're going to have one of those uh, fantastic vents again with that really pretty wood covering that matches your cabinets. And then behind me, you're going to see a really pretty mirrored ward. So we'll go ahead and open this up for you. So as you saw, the LED lights are going to come on. You're going to have carpet back here. You're going to have ample shoe and storage space. You're going to have a safe back here along with a hanging rod. And then you can also have storage on the sides here. And we'll close that up and open this side for you. And again, you're gonna have an additional shoe storage and then another hanging rod here that you can either use or take out, but it just provides extra leveling of space here. And then real quick, before we wrap things up in the bathroom, you're gonna have your egress door with your really pretty balances here. So you can have it in a lock position. You'll turn this unlocked, and then you're gonna wanna unlock it down there below as well, so it opens up as so it has two locks and two unlocks. Open this up. You're gonna have a magnetic cover here. So this comes on and off. And then simply, as you can see, um, due to the weather, I'm not gonna do it just cause it's really cold out, but you can unwrap that Velcro and basically you're gonna just drop that ladder and it's gonna fall down. And you can step on the commode or step around and you can have easy access outside. But what that does is, obviously for safety reasons, if there was a fire or what have you, you can use this to escape out the back. Or if you wanted to load anything up, with it being a 45 foot coach, it's gonna take a lot of stuff to fill up. So if you have any of your towelettes, your bathroom stuff, your clothes or shoes, you can have someone inside loading and have someone lifting up to load it from the outside as well. So that's just an additional use to the secondary egress door in the back. Before we say goodbye and wrap up this London Air 4551, I wanted to go ahead and point out our awnings. So what you're gonna see above me is gonna be our two Nova awnings out. You're also gonna see our powered entry door awning as well. Those are really big and unique features to Newmar and we wanted to give those a nice solid look and what a better place to end on. But make sure when you have those out, if it gets windy, you put those away because you don't want any damage to happen to those on the road or at your campsite. I'm Megan Stouter and I can't thank you enough for joining us again to explore our 2022 London Air 4551. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach us here at Newmar Sales and Service or contact one of our local dealers across the country. They're there to help you and make this process as fun and enjoyable as possible. Again, this London Air is luxury, it's sexy, it's sleek, and it's made just for you. Thanks.